everyone. Friday, May 6th, 11, 16 a.m. I like really don't have time for anything YouTube related right now, but this is so, so important. Um, so I wanted to share it and post some links below. Um, so while people are pass states are passing laws to put menstrual products in boys' bathrooms, this is going on on the abortion front. Um, I just got this email from the United States Conference of Catholic Bishops, and it's a call to action. And they say the following. In response to the leak of a draft opinion in the Supreme Court case of Dobbs versus Jackson Women's Health Organization, Majority Leader Senator Chuck Schumer has scheduled another Senate vote to try to enshrine abortion on demand in federal law through the so-called Women's Health Protection Act, S-4132. The vote will be held next Wednesday, May 11th, and is the sec and it is the second time this year that a vote on the bill will take place. The Senate held a vote on February 28th to advance this bill, and that vote failed. This deceptively named extreme bill would impose abortion on demand nationwide at any stage of pregnancy through federal statute. Even worse, it would eliminate modest and widely supported pro-life laws at every level of government, the federal, state, and local, including parental notification for minor girls, informed consent, and health or safety protection specific to abortion facilities. It would force all Americans to support abortions here and abroad with their tax dollars. It would also likely force healthcare providers and professionals to perform assistant or and or refer for abortion against their deeply held beliefs as well as force employers and insurers to cover or pay for abortion. Um, and so they're asking um, for us to click on a link and send a message to the Senate. So it says we need to send an unmistakable message to the Senate that this horrible bill must never be enacted. Join Archbishop Lori, chairman of the Committee on Pro-Life Act Activities, and Cardinal Dolan, chairman of the Committee for the Religious Liberty, in urging the Senate to oppose this bill. And then there's some links to the chairman's letter, fact sheet, and a statement issued by Archbishop Jose H. Gomez of Los Angeles. Um, so I'm going to share all those links below. It's super, I mean, the Democrats just fight so dirty. So obviously somebody leaked it so they could do what they're doing. <laughs> because they had to create a crisis because the bill didn't pass the first time. So now that they have the whole world's attention and they have their minions of Antifa and who, whatever other comm commies minions funded by George Soros, burning down D.C. or whatever it is they're doing. Um, now they're going to use that to try to push this through and say, see, the people want abortion and all stuff. So it's important that we do make our voices heard. That is all. Joan of Arc Media out. Links below.